the big kaboom. Where is my where where is she? <laughs> She's gone. <clears throat> Critical failure in the cryogenic array. All vault resumes. Re res resume idea. <laughs> Yeet. Thank you for the money. Okay. What do we want for a name? What's a, like, ginger name? What's a good ginger name? Phoenix. Phoenix. Cuff. Actually, do that. That works. And we will take that. So, another thing I installed is this. Which is health history. And now we have like a kind of like perk system. Like New Vegas pops in my mind. Like how that is. Um, I think I normally go. I want to do a guns kind of thing. So I think I'm going to get trigger discipline. So slow and steady wins the race. While using ranged weapons. You will fire slower by 20%. But you are 20% more accurate. And that is me. So, God, it's bright. so we have this install, which is the universal workbench, which allows me to basically carry the workbench in my inventory and anywhere I am, I can place it down and use it as a workbench. Oh. Wait, what? If you're reading this, you must have escaped the tyranny that is the overseer. Anyone from Vault come across these? Huh? What? What do I have installed? Vault refuge base. The fuck do I? I see. This is what I meant by I have no idea how to mod. I miss my wife, Cotsworth. Cut. Somebody had Taco Bell. <laughs> to completely just complete. Uh, Codsworth is just going off. Um, to completely scrap. <laughs> completely get rid of Sanctuary. Just everything needs to scrap it. All of it. That's, That's an, an awful awfully hot, hot coffee, coffee pot. pot. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. Is this a fucking automatic? Oh my god, it's an automatic. What the fuck? Please go. Just, just die, please. Just. Okay. Listen, bitch. I don't remember what hotkey button that is. Please. Um, good to know that this is an automatic revolving pistol. Bump. Shit. 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 Oh. Send. Easy. We have, uh, the- the- that spider mod and so I wonder because um if I remember correctly it adds a new like dungeon or something so I wonder if like we had to go to the survivors and they'll be like overrun by uh, spiders I forgot exactly everything that I was saying in settlements on my own on my own playthrough and I've been really really enjoying um, doing it right now I have pretty much sanctuary built up fully there's a couple things I want to add to sanctuary but um, it's pretty much done so if you guys want to see like a quick little video on like my sanctuary um, build or where at least where it's at right now then let me know but I think we're just going to scrap 
all of Sanctuary. We're done scrapping uh, I built a bed moved all the workstations in here so we should be able to go into traps I'm trying to make sure that like I make like the perfect amount Gonna put it into idiot savant. There we go, back down. So as you can see, I can like make things. So um what I am not going to do is like for instance this. Uh, I need five more aluminium. I'm not gonna make any weapons or like the vertebrate sword like this. I unless I can't get this in uh, like level listing and stuff, then I would make it, but I think I'm pretty sure you can, I would be able to. So. Okay. We've leveled up twice. So, let's get gun nut. Uh, and armor. And then we're gonna run. And we're gonna then. We're gonna go scrap red rocket. I knew this was gonna happen. Also, this is a part of the mod. I feel like there's way more mole rats than like usual. All right, we've scrapped red rocket. So now we run all the way back to sanctuary. Just dog meat, dog meat, dog meat, dog meat, dog meat. Now we just do one. Ah. Oh yeah, I created a backpack as well because I can. Oh god, this is gonna be fucking. Chaotic shit. Put them. It's another them. It's like the, uh. Also, because of how. When I have a mod installed uh, that animates the deliver different. Not aim. Okay. Fucking chaos. Oh, this would have been easier if I just picked this door, but whatever. Hello, Preston. Sturgis. 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 I wish I could skip all of this fucking dialogue. Ginger Man is here to the rescue, though. I'm fucking over encumbered. That's funny. Dog meat. You are gonna have to carry some more shit, because apparently, even though I'm in power armor, we are gonna quick save because I have no faith in myself. Oh, I almost fell down. Cheesed. Um, I think I'm going to try to persuade Wolfgang. Carla. Also, you'll notice that uh, people don't look like their normal selves. Cool. Can I get it more? Let's see. 
Oh my god. Sweet. We should also notice that uh, I have arms because we installed the pit pad. Yeah, you know, my arm just has a hole in it, apparently. Oh shit, I forgot there was a bunch of- Oh god! Okay. Uh, hey, can you uh, just, just hold on? Just right, thank you. Ah, what the fuck? Sometimes that scares me. Oh, it's over here. I'm dumb. Yes. Where? I'm dumb. Oh! I'm it's dumb. you. Found him. Want some more? <clears throat> that was easy. What up, Cynthia boy? Watch me fail this. Oh! Okay, that's a minor alert. Not really. I think I just shot fucking dog meat. Ooh, dude, just doing your job. Protecting Diamond City means keeping me out. Is that it? Oh, look, it's the big scary reporter. Boo. I need help. What's up, Mayor McDonut? Damn it. Shit! Fuck it. Wow, you don't take bribes. What if I just... What if I keep... What if I just... I just need Danny. 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 I don't know if you can hear my chair squeaking. So, sorry if you can, uh, it's pretty much whenever I move a micro inch, uh, my scare, my scare, my square, my chair, squeaks. Why did I have such a struggle with saying, sh <laughs> about that. I do want to talk to Ellie to go get the quest, but, uh, I want to find like, suck, not stuck. I want to get, um, duh, duh, oh my God, my, ink, oh my God. English, please, good God. So we gotta go towards this way because good neighbor's somewhere over here, and then somewhere up here is the old north church. I remember correctly. Maybe next time. I remember correctly. Maybe next time. Coffee cup. I think we're done. Stop eating the bed. Jeez. What are you fucking that one chick from My Strange Addictions? How much you guys want to bet that I don't get this? Don't ask anyone. Nobody. Don't put that in editing me. <laughs> fuck, 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 fuck. I'm stuck. I'm actually stuck. What the fuck? Hey. I'm stuck. Help. <laughs> I jumped, hold on, I jumped for like a split second there. <laughs> let me, just, let me. Oh. Where am I? Holy rad roaches! My plan is to set up the ultimate factory in this run for through I totally forgot that there was uh, additions to add factory pieces to this game and so I haven't been using the factory stuff because I forgot it existed until the other day where uh, I learned that factories existed because I was watching some videos on Fallout 4 mods because I've been into Fallout 4 for like a week now and I came across a video of somebody who made at the Starlight Drive-In movie theater they made um 
Is it Starlight Di Diner or Starlight Drive-In? Whatever the hell it's called. And they made a factory that decomposed uh, bodies. You know, it, it ate them up. And it completely scrapped everything and made like ammo and stuff from it. Which is pretty cool. So I want to do... I want to do some factories to create ammo. Because like, I can craft ammo. But... I want to make it cool. <laughs> Abbott. Abbott. Guess what? I got some paint. Refuge base. Oh. Well, there's a railroad call sign. Follow me, boy. Isn't that the call sign for danger or some shit? Understood. Oh. I just walked through this. Oh my god. That's fucking terrifying. Oh my god, and it's a legendary. Ow! Thought you got taken care of. Oh my god. What now? Ow! Okay, 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 okay. I'm just gonna use a stim pack. Spider. I there was one time where I was cleaning a table out in uh, trade school. Like, we had a clean, obviously. Uh, and I cleaned the underside and shoved my hand in a bunch of spider eggs and uh, almost wanted to die. Anyway. Alright. I managed to fix this old terminal that we you that we found in the sewer drain. That, the place already looked... Well, lived in, maybe homeless people, but anyways, we left Vault 111 almost six months ago. Okay. So this is like, right after the ball, okay. So we have a split from the main group to look for family and friends. Hi. <laughs> well, those who traveled with me headed west. We are only a fraction of the people we had now, only 13 living down here. Just looked at that. So I found out people have been going through the supply caches without my permission. Do they not understand our supply is more dire? We have Herman and Henry scavenging out there. We gave them our quality suits and weaponry. Hopefully, they don't come back empty-handed. People are frustrated and I understand that. I'm trying to be a good leader on like the overseer. Please just give it some time, guys. Ticking. I'm not a plumber. But the ticking in the pipes does not sound normal. We sent uh, Mara, Mira, up through the pipes a few hours ago. We have not heard from her since. I swear this, she is either stuck or some kind of animal got through the pipes. Probably a stray dog. All right, so Edwin, Ross, Nestor went through the pipes and they could not even find remains of Mara. I'm worried, but if there are no remains, it means she must have left through the pipes. Oh, on the bright side, Herman and Henry managed to find a crashed Super Duper Mart shipping truck. They have a lot of resources. But they brought back, brought in a few new faces, two little kids and three women. We did so well. We got our first real bad fight today. Uh, fists were flying, and I can tell that it was one of those three girls who started the fight. Herman looks like he had a sprained, sp had a sprain, so we could get send him up. Send Henry up top with Clint. Though Clint has been nothing but quiet this whole time. I'm worried about the man's mental state. Ticking came back. This time it's more detectable from where it is coming from. I spent... One of the new girls and Clint into the pipes, this time with pistols. They shot at something, but the new girl had a huge bite mark in her arm. I knew it was some fucking animal. But hopefully, it doesn't have any disease or fleas. All new girls, the two children, and Herman are all gone. Most of our supply cache is gone too. Knew nothing good was coming out of this. I'm sending Henry and Clint up top, and hopefully they can get something for just a week. To those who are reading this, you will be you will be dead soon. I'll grab some security armor and head out of this place. You guys can fend f 
for your own supplies. Now there is just enough for one of you, though. Seriously, guys, fuck you. I was trying to help you, but I was trying to help, but you, Clint, trying to smother me in my sleep is enough. By the way, I knew what the ticking was since the middle of June. I didn't trust anyone not to read the my terminal. There are giant fucking spiders in these pipes. I don't know where they came from and I don't care. Fuck you guys. I'm heading out. Fight for your own supplies and try to fend off the spiders. Sincerely, the one man who is trying to fucking help you guys and keep us together. And we never get a single name. Oh, it's a laser musket or some type of laser that is not a guitar. Or a no, no. Oh, dialogue. Ah, uh, Piper, don't mind the. Pi Piper, we might. I'm sure they're not attacking dog meat. And dog meat's fine. And we need to go, I think, somewhere over here. If I remember correctly. I've played this game like for almost 100 hours now. And yet, I still don't know where things are. Oh. Where's Good River? I need to get to Good Neighbor. I need to stop getting fucking sidetracked. Discover the fucking railroad before the no, the, the before before the, the Lord's church before I get to fucking good neighbor. I spell fucking road R O D. Why don't you tell me first? Holy shit! I actually passed that. Cool. Anyway, I follow the Freedom Trail. <laughs> yes, because. Good neighbor. Oh my god. Played this game like for almost a hundred hours now. Thank you. We did it. It only took fifty three fucking minutes. No. What's up? What the fuck, yes. Deacon? Deacon, the other one. Deacon. Deacon, where are you? In what are you? Sin City wasn't made. What the fuck? Where did you come from? I swear to fucking God, I'm gonna kill you, Deacon. I I will fucking murder you. In He's right there! Now, see, if I was in power armor, I would just deep myself off, but 
if I yeet myself off, I die with this harem. This game, what do you mean? There's a motherfucking harem. Talk, click, click it out of it. My God, tries reset. It fucking does. <laughs> Yo, it's sick. I didn't know that was a thing. So here is the pinnacle point where I actually do what I set out to do today, which was build up Sanctuary within our first episode at the very end of the episode. Now, of course, I'm always late to doing things, so this isn't very unusual, but I kind of wanted to talk a little bit about the idea for what I'm doing. So I want to do this in the style of a I'm not going to plan out when these videos are coming out recording sessions things english <clears throat> but normally for series i'll do a video every week every two weeks try to get out two to three a month and they're typically at least uh on paper planned in practice they are never planned but i want to take my time with this I've gotten to a point in my kind of YouTube career here uh, that I want to take my time with things. I want to take time with editing. I want to take time with recording. And so this is going to be kind of the experiment series. And it's not Minecraft. For once in my life, I'm not doing a Minecraft series, at least right now. That may change depending on some things. And that may be happening soon. I want to get into kind of doing more than one series. You see, I love Immortal, uh, 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 Immortal Lands and Immortal Lands Rebirth. Both of them were honestly one of my better series when it came to Minecraft, at least. And I enjoyed doing that. But I also wanted to do more than just Minecraft. And so I branched out and I slowly stopped doing Immortal Lands Rebirth. And I got to the point where I didn't really want to record it anymore. So I stopped the series. But that may change. Not bringing back Immortal Lands Rebirth, but a different series on Minecraft. And I want to record more than just one goddamn series. Typically what happens is I'll say I'll do a series and then I don't release any other content or very little different content than what I'm doing a series on. Like Immortal Lands Rebirth, I occasionally, I'm pretty sure, did different content. And then I got to the point where I just didn't really want to play Minecraft anymore. So I stopped recording it and did other things. And so, yeah. Then I took a hiatus and now we're back and everything's different. <clears throat> but what I want to do is I want to take my time with this. I genuinely like recording. Streaming, in my opinion, is better. So we'll probably do some streams on this. But uh, yeah, pretty much this entire section here is just me upgrading Sanctuary. Uh, between upgrading Sanctuary and getting parts and different components, I decided that uh, at one point I will upgrade my water purification and just go for two hours and get what I need. So that's what I, this real fun loop, game loop right there. Just make water and sell water. But yeah. So I want to release this whenever the hell I feel like releasing this. For instance, this is the first episode. Don't expect me to tell you, hey, next week there will be a new Fallout episode. I might record some Fallout here and there, but it's not going to be edited into a fucking video until much later when I get into it. But even though I just talked about experimental, this was also experimental because I had no idea what I was doing. I think the first like half of this video 
maybe not half, but it was just a bunch of recordings of me not knowing what to do. I got lost trying to find Good Neighbor for a goddamn hour. That was not fun. And then everything kind of just went uphill from there. Basically, the start of this video was just in like recording it at least was just completely downhill. And yeah, I did find Ada and talked with her a little bit here to start the quest line, uh, which we will do some more in the next episode. Uh, so I did some of her quests just to get some XP and because I didn't want to do any more in Sanctuary, to be quite honest with all of you. Uh, I was a little burnt out, so I decided to do some other things. But next episode, I think I want to focus on kind of doing more of the main quest line and mainly so I can get Nick unlocked. But yeah, I did the Ada's, Ada's stuff, came back and got in the, the feels again to do Sanctuary. But I wanted to do quite a bit of uh, the kind of start out of this episode. So this one might be a bit longer than the next episode just because it's starting out. And I wanted to get a lot of this out of the way, mainly building up Sanctuary. But the idea for all of this, this series at least, is to build up all of the settlements and do good and side quests and actually kind of complete the game instead of two episodes and then calling it quits like I did on Xbox. But yeah, so off camera, I might do some more to Sanctuary, get some more caps. So next episode, we can just focus on doing quest stuff. But I do hope all of you enjoyed. I do hope that this series will actually kick off pretty well. And I don't know if I'm going to do another style of like a uh, follow video. Um, these are very uh, cut and just random clips put together. So uh, yeah, I definitely will see you guys in the next episode. I do hope you enjoyed. Remember to water your seatbelts and you could hit that subscribe button if you'd like. Peace.